Hi and welcome to another video. I just wanted to do a quick review of the latest release for uh, Merlin Asus WRT. Uh, so that's the custom firmware for Asus uh, routers. Um, and it also includes our new our, uh, router, the GTAX 11000. Uh, so the new stable release that's just come out is uh, 386.2 underscore 6. So you might be on underscore 4 currently but uh, 5 was used normally for beta testing so normally jumps to if you could if you're a regular and you can when you're updating so don't be too worried that you missed an update uh, so this one is just a, a release out um, from the actual official um, firmware that comes from Asus um, that you might have seen in my previous video that uh, fixes one of the vulnerabilities in the Wi-Fi called frag attack um, so this just incorporates that and adds a few fixes to it. So it's not a major release, but it is a security uh, patch. So it's quite good. And as we say, um, Merlin, uh, the firmware and everything else is kept near enough on par uh, on updates and things like that from uh, Asus. And if anything, because of the extra features, it does make it more stable. Um, so it's really good. So now we'll just quickly go on to some details. So this is the uh, change log that you might notice within the uh, uh, website. So this just goes through the different firmware versions. As you can see, it does jump to, as you can see there, from 2 to 4 to 6. So as like I said, the one in between is like normally a beta testing version. So the one we're interested in the 6th of June, so it's only just come out in the last few days. Uh, the first one is just to note that the IRC channel, so that's like the chat, um, that has actually moved now to Libra IRC network. So you've got the website there and where you can download the client for whichever operating system you have or mobile device. Um, it is really good. So if you do want to join, um, then you're uh, very welcome there. It's got the hashtag as well, Asus WRT to join the IRC channel. Uh, also, secondly, it's updated chart uh, JavaScript to 2.94. So what Chart.js basically does is just uh, is a simple JavaScript for charting. So it makes it look nice. And this upgrade has just fixed a few bugs and, and added performance. So it's quite good. Uh, Tor. So as we all know, Tor is for like um, if you want to obscure your uh, Internet connection. So that's been upgraded to the latest uh, version. And uh, thirdly, they've updated now the root certificate bundle. So before it was an earlier date, so now they've uh, increased it to June the 5th, uh, 2021. So it's been extended to then. Um, and then also, lastly, the as we said before, it's now fixed and incorporated the frag attack security issues that was incorporated for the Wi-Fi drivers. So that's now uh, good to see. And as I said, this official firmware came out a few days ago with the frag attack security issues and Merlin has now just uh, incorporated them as well. So that he, and don't forget this is all sponsored. Uh, so he doesn't get paid or anything like that. So if you do want to donate and you enjoy some of his firmware that he actually supplies and updates and the work he does, then I would advise to come to this website and then, uh, and then donate some money if you can. Uh, so thirdly, we'll just go on to where you can download it. So now we can go to the download uh, tab at the top and as you can see you've got the mirror, the OneDrive and also the main download site and the pre-beta test drive, uh, tests if you want as well. Uh, so you can download those as well, it's got some features but of course if you are going for a pre-test uh, build just be aware that this will have bugs and everything else so if you're going to use it as your main router then I'd advise not to. So we just go to the main download site and that will take you to SourceForge. As we go down, you can see all the different routers for your Asus. We just go to the GTAX 11000, uh, that's specific to our router. And then you've got beta and release. So you just really want to go to release. And then you'll see the top version there um, from the 6th of the 6th, uh, 2021. And the size of it comes in at 63.9 megabytes. You just download that, unzip it, and you just uh, and you then can upload it to your uh, router. Um, as I said, I do advise that um, you always back up your settings as well, but um, it's been quite stable. I've never had any issues going between Merlin, this third party uh, firmware 
and the actual official Asus uh, firmware as well because they are both compatible with each other. So yes, just a quick rundown of all the features that um, that was actually changed as you can see here. So if you do have any questions or you want um, to leave any comments, then please do. Okay, thanks for watching and have a great day.